Welcome back to Fallout 4, the horror modded gameplay that I've got running on at the moment. So we're going to go and summon Black Philip, but before we do that, um, there's somebody else that I want to go and pick up to add to a little, uh, a little squad, shall we say. So I need to hop over to Lexington, and the closest that I've got on my map is actually Lexington. So we're going to go from Lexington and go to Lexington Apartments. Right, it looks like we're going to have a little bit of fun getting to the apartments. Um, at least the weather's holding out, and I did deliberately wait until the morning before um, before fast travelling here. So that hopefully we won't have uh, too many of the nighttime terrors on our case. And also, hopefully, there won't be too many ghouls and this lot. Barrels. They're just coming out of the woodwork. They're coming from every. Oh, shit! I did not see him there. God. Well, I see there, but Come on, shoot straight. Oh, I'm going to hide under this wall. That way, hopefully, the uh, the turret can't get me. Right, here we go. Lexington Apartments. Okay, so we've got Foxy Butt Spanks and we've got Heather. And there's one more person that I want to add. It's going to uh, loot the settler. He doesn't need any of his equipment. Oh my god, I forgot about the mine. Bugger, bugger, bugger. I forgot about the mine. So I think it's in here we want to go. There we go. So we have... We have a whole ruck going on here. So the witch hunter come in. And the girl in the white dress does not like witch hunters. But that's not what we're here for. Really? That's another one? Anyway, hopefully for any more witch hunters come in. This is Darlene. What are you doing here? I don't want any trouble. I'm just passing through. You're passing through my home, you know that? I'm sorry. I didn't know. <laughs> It's okay. You're welcome. So, who are you? I'm a fellow vault dweller. Nice to meet you, fellow vault dweller. And you are? I'm... I'm darling. I'm darling. I'm darling. Hey, are you alright? Yeah, definitely. Definitely a okay. What are you? I'm... Yeah. I'm darling. Ugh. Another robot. I'm darling. Come on, don't bullshit me. You know what? I got an idea. You look like someone who can handle himself on the road and I need a walk. What do you mean by that? I mean, I've got a job for you. What's the job? It's very, very simple. You take me with you and we travel together. I told you, it is simple. Wait. What am I supposed to do? You don't have anything special to do. You just live your life and I follow you on the road. If you take the job, I will give you something. It's a little device that can teleport anything with a good encoded designation. Like me. It's like a drum drive, but stronger. How much are you paying? You see the suitcase? It's filled with small beans. They were beans. There's about $1,000. Listen, I'm not trying to mess with you. I just want to get the hell out of here. Calm down. I'm listening. Oh, you want a job? Oh, you don't. Now, tell me. Yes, absolutely. Let's get the hell out of here. I'm so glad to get the hell out of here. So there we have it. That's Darlene. Let me uh, recruit her properly. Hey. Hey. Ready to move? Ready. Great then. Let's go. Right, so I've not had Darlene in any of my gameplays before. I normally have Heather. Yeah. Um, she's uh, Heather's obviously uh, probably one of the most popular follower mods, and she's also probably one of the fully most fully rounded with a good backstory and everything else. Um, but Darlene was recommended to me by Angel Phoenix. So thank you very much for that recommendation, and we'll see how we get on with Darlene in our uh, in our squad. 
But anyway, what we're going to do now is uh, first you get out of here. Let's do that first. Right, so now that we're out there, we need to... Uh, who uh, misses? We need to go over to Salem, which is right over on the east coast. Around about here, so I'm going to put a marker down. Uh, it's past Dunwich Borers, but this is where we're going to head to. To uh, hopefully... Um, one Black Philip. So this is the Church of Salem, I believe. And we got to go and find some old boy to help now. Oh, didn't see that coming out by there. For some reason I didn't flag up as an enemy, I don't think. Kill the Mylux, one of three, I can hear him. Yeah, it's dead. Whoa, corpse liquor, what the hell? What the hell is that? Barney, hello Barney. Hey, what are you doing down there? Look out! They're coming right at you! Are you crazy? Get out of the street before any more of them catch wind of you! Look, I'll open the gate, and you get in here quick! I can't I'm actually let see. In the bunker. Don't make me regret this! Come on, let me in, Barney. Oh, gate okay, opens outwards. And how do we get in there, then? Okay, it's very bright indoors. And what we want to do, we'll have a chat with him first of all, let's get this out of the way. Lady, did someone drop you on your head as a baby? Now, just be careful. All your noise probably woke up more crabbies and other mire lurks. The town could be crawling with them by now. Right, but that's not what we're here to do. We're gonna... She's just vomiting everywhere. I have no idea. You know, we're going to have a little snooze, I think. Is that card on there? Pin up 11 in Light the Dog. Another trading card. Cool. Asleep till midnight. There we go. The beasts have awakened, survived the night, and watched for shadows. Well, I know it's a bit foggy, but what I'm hoping is that we get sucked off. Uh, sucked off to hell, that is. So that came out a bit wrong, didn't it? And they're in my way. So we're going to fight everything we see and hopefully, yeah, we get sucked off to hell. Get a little bit of XP while we're at it. The roads keep you safe from the beast. Survive the scarecrow. Uh, what scarecrow? Don't like the sound of this. You left the road's protection. Okay, does this mean we're going to have a scarecrow after us or something? So you wanna play? You die. I, I keep leaving the road's protection and get back on it again. Oh no, where this scarecrow is. Come on. No idea. Can anybody see a scarecrow anywhere? Aha, the scarecrow. Kill. Doesn't really look like a scarecrow that much, to be fair. Oh, I survived tonight. That's kind of not what I really wanted to do. So it looks like I'm going to have to go and sleep for another another day. Right. Where's Barney's house? We need to sleep again. Survive the slender. All right, let's go find this slender. Heads up. Not like I can see anything. I don't get out of here. Got 
Shadow. Always the way that I go. Always the opposite way to the way I want to go. Oh, where's this slender thing then? Get a companion to dislike enough and they refuse to travel with you. Yeah, I kind of knew that. Oh, what is that in the distance there? That looks like the slender. Well, he's a handsome devil. Is that me getting shot at? Something's hitting me there. I don't know if he's his uh, Barney's turrets or something else. It's not really doing a lot, is it? So for some reason I can't damage the Slender. And it's not moving anyway, so it's not really a threat. We'll wait over here. Looks like it's a good job Foxy's got infinite bullets, isn't it? Yo, dude. So, whoa, 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 Apparently I feel confused now. Yeah. Not too sure why. Uh, I guess we're going to find out in a minute. Hey, listen, I'm not Haunted ghoul. Oh, here come the baddies anyway. Yeah, was a great fight. More ghouls. Grim oh, yeah. Lord, oh my god, we've had one of these before. to do nice where's the rest of the grim lord got to then not a lot's happening at the moment not a lot at all okay i think this is uh glitch so i'm gonna go and sleep for another night Hell's hat. What the hell? Come on, what the? Jesus Christ, suicide that thing. But I'm not going out just yet. I'll let my companions do that. Hell's hell. No, okay. thank you. Well, where is this thing? It was massive. See it then. Gotta get some hits in, so I'll get some XP from it. No, 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 get away, get away, she's coming for me. Wow, it moves fast as well. It's literally just. Skitted over there somewhere. Did we get it? Not gonna lie, I'm a little bit worried about going out here. The road keeps you safe from the beast. That's right over there. What is it doing? You survived the night. Really? So to survive the night, you just gotta kill these things. I don't know what it's doing over here, but it's uh, dead now. But if we survive tonight, I might as well sleep until the next one. We really need to get uh, get to hell. Okay, so tonight we've got to survive the creeper daddy. Ow. What the hell? Yeah, that's right. The creeper's daddy. Let's show the back. Oh, that's it just there, isn't it? At least we can shoot it through the fence. No idea where it's gone. Can't see anything. Is it worth going out and having a look? It's 
probably going to get eaten by this thing anyway. A ninth circle creature has appeared. Watch out. We've got a creeper's daddy and a ninth circle creature. Good timing. I was looking for a target. Well, let's go and see if we can take out this uh, creeper's daddy first. Probably don't want to be out here on my top though. Zombie down there. Picture zombie. There's a tiny little thing there. Very difficult to see with all this mist. You ready to die, asshole? No, I'm not. Oh, he wasn't talking to me. Sorry. <laughs> Somewhere there's a ninth circle creature, and I um, don't think we did actually kill the uh, creeper's daddy, so that's lurking around somewhere as well. This road keeps you safe from beasts. Fair enough. Like American Wealth in London, don't stray from the roads. Oh, I found the creepers, Daddy. Gone that way. Lost him again. Yeah. Right. Uh, looks like Foxy's found him. Oops, I just shot um, Heather, I think. Survive the night and we get creature da creeper daddy's blindfold. Right, still need to go and meet Black Philip though. None of this is really helping. Alright, so now we've got a ninth circle creature again. You are losing your mind. Maybe this is what we need to happen before we can get sucked off to hell. A few hours later. Okay, so this is probably going to be my last night that I try and get sucked away by Black Phillip. I'm in the right area to meet him because I know that he, uh, he appears at the entrance to the church, uh, which is there. But I have been trying for six real life hours to get sucked off to hell so I can check with Black Phillip. And I'm not going to lie, nothing's happened. The game's crashed a few times. I've had loads of cursed ghouls, loads of zombies, a few creeper daddies, uh, some witches, possibly a werewolf, some hell beasts, and lots of other unpleasant things coming at me even the things that you can't see like that vampire that you can't see over there got up a few levels there we go survive the creeper daddy he's over there somewhere that big ass thing over there and all I'm going to do is he's going to go and stand in here and he can't get me and they can go and shoot him so yeah, normally about midnight you get sucked off the hill, you can meet your Black Phillip and that actually completes that part of the quest. But as I said a minute ago, I've been waiting here about six real life hours. Which is a, a crazy amount of time just to get sucked off to hell. Come on. Is that all you got? There you go, there's a big ass thing over there. 
I've killed that so many times I managed to get his blindfold, which you can see me wearing there. And that is supposed to, let me show you real quick. Creeper Daily Blindfold is supposed to, uh, creatures no longer affect your mental health. It's a very rare job. I've got three of them. So that's how many Creeper Daddies I've killed. But I do seem to be going a bit mad. You're mine now. Uh, that was a witch thing there. And some sort of headless thing there. I've got all of Grimm's notes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. I've got all of Grimm's notes now. Read them all, still nothing. Um, I've even fixed some of Barney's turrets. Um, some of them have been blown up again. I'm not sure how that happened, but some have got them. So there we go, Creep Daddy once again. Once uh, we killed him, we've survived the night. Big ass thing. Yeah, for some reason he can't get me in here. And yep, he keeps healing. The game's crashed about a dozen times. So that is possibly when I'm about to be sucked off to hell. I don't know. So it's possible I've got a mod conflict, which is um, caused me to not get sucked off to hell. I cannot get it to end, and I'm not going to lie. I've had enough of trying now. So this is my last night. And if it doesn't happen tonight, then I'm going to disable the quest part of this mod. And move on. Right, so there we go. I survived the night. I didn't get sucked off to hell. Fox is going mad with a minigun. And I've still got weird ghost things running at me. So I am not going to be playing this mod anymore because I've had enough. Um, I'm sure the mod itself is absolutely fine. I've got another creeper daddy. Maybe the mod's not fine, I don't know. It's more than likely I've got a mod conflict, but I have no idea what it is or where it is. Everything else has worked absolutely fine up until now. But I ain't getting sucked off nowhere, am I? And I'm not spending any more hours and hours of my life waiting for this to happen. So unfortunately, I am going to have to say that I failed abysmally. Uh, we're going to have to move on to something else in the next episode. Um, because I can't do it! Well, anyway, my apologies to everyone for a lame ending. Hope you enjoyed the rest of the series, the rest of the videos I made. Um, don't bother giving this video a like, I don't think it deserves it. But, just in case you do, well, thank you very much. And we, or me and the team, and not her she's going we will see you in the next episode so let's just um end this now yeah come on take her out we're gonna end this now and we're gonna move on oh my god well she's just giving heather a damn good kick in, isn't she I don't even think about it coming for me. Right, she's gone. Hell's gates are closed. Don't know what that red dot was for. Yeah, so that's it. We're going to go find something else to do now. Thanks for watching, everyone. See you again soon. Bye-bye now.